Now we have some more from Russia. This is the briefing given a short time ago at the Russian Defense Ministry. We of US airplanes were used M15, M16, and also the planes of the of US of the UK tornado in Mediterranean, and also the ships on the on the real on Yakun of US forces from the Red Sea. Also bombers, fighter bombers, BN1, but they also flew over Syrian uh, territory in the Ektan region, which is controlled by USA. Also, a, a series of uh, Syrian air, air, airports were, were bombed, uh, and the research centers were bombed. According to preliminary data, the, the victims among the s s citizens and uh, uh, personnel, and personnel, there are no victims. The information will be clarified and it will be informed to the people. According to the information, were used 103 cruise missiles were used, including Tomahawk, and also monitored air bombs from the planes B. 1B, F-15, F-16 planes used to uh, missiles, land, soil, also tornado of, of UK, the, the um, uh, eight, eight, eight missiles were, were used, and, and also Syrian, uh, Syrian forces, they also repelled some, some uh, attacks, Intercept, 71 cruise missiles were intercepted, were activated, Syrian uh, forces were used, S-20, S-200, Puk, dif Square, uh, different, it, it testifies to the high, high effective effectiveness of the armament in, in Syria and also excellent train and training of Syrians prepared by our specialists. According, Russia has fully restored the system of air defense of Syria and, and continues to improve it over the last six months. A few years ago, taking into account this, we refused to supply to, to Syria of the Zenith miss missiles S-300. Taking into account or what has happened, I consider it necessary to, to reconsider this issue, not in respect to Syria, but also in respect to other states. The aims of the strike were also the aviation basis of, of Syrian forces. The, the objective data. Duvali Airport, four, four missiles were taking part. Also Dumir, 12, 12 missiles were used, they were shot down. Buri Airport, 18 missiles, they were shot down. Shairat Airport, 12 missiles, all were shot down. And the air, airports didn't suffer any losses. Out of nine missiles launched uh, towards the Mize Airport, five missiles were shot down. Out of 16 missiles, Against Homs Airport, 13 were destroyed. There were no serious destructions. 30 missiles took part in the strikes in the objects in the, about the settlements, Barza and Germany settlements. Seven missiles were shot down. These objects allegedly ha that had to do with the so-called uh, chemical program of Damascus, who were partly destroyed, partially destroyed, but well, but they haven't been used for a long time, and there was no other equipment there. Russian forces of air were, were put into a combative regime. None of the cruise missiles, our air defense complexes were not used. We think that this strike is not the response to the alleged chemical attack, but it's, it's uh, against the armed forces of Syria. The strike is inflicted on the day when in Damascus should start working a special mission on the investigation of the incident in Duma and allegedly that allegedly uh, chemical weapons were used there. I want to call your attention that none of the objects on the production of chemical 
uh, weapons in Syria don't exist. And it was established by the Organization for, for the Prohibition of Chemical Weapons. This fact of American aggression testifies about that there's, the, there's no interest of the USA to have an objective investigation, but an aspiration to thwart the process of the peaceful settlement and to destabilize the situation in the Near East and has nothing to do with the declared aims to, to fight international terrorism is assessed as calm. You can observe it in the real-time regime on the screens. We attentively monitor the situation taking place there. 